Buari is the one stopping Namdi Kano's freedom. Tunubu confessed, unveiled hidden secrets behind the last hearing. You see? You can now see, you can now see where the truth lies now. Hmm. Bad leaders. Why will Dubari be interfering? Why will Tunubu give that room for Bari to interfere? Is he, is he Tunubu not the incumbent president of Nigeria? Is it because he, Tunubu, has decided not to arrest Bari? Despite all of his crimes? I greet everybody out there listening to this very broadcast. It is a pleasure. Um, nice meeting you once again, and um, I, I greet all of you, all of you, no be small matter. Um, on this very uh, content, we'll be sensitizing you facts and reality and secrets behind the continued detention of Mazi Namdi Kanu and who is behind it. You'll be shocked. You'll be shocked. Let's check the content. This is today's news. In a bold stance against continued legal proceedings, the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOP, has adamantly rejected the further count trial of its leader, Mazi Namde Kanu. This resolute position follows the recent development surrounding Kanu's legal status, including his acquittal by the appeal court and subsequent trial on terrorism by the federal government. Despite the appeal court ruling on October 13th, 2022, which discharged and acquitted Kanu of all charges, the federal government persisted in prosecuting him. Kanu has been held in Department of State Services DSS detention since 2021, following his controversial arrest in Kenya and subsequently extradition to Nigeria. On December 15, 2023, the Supreme Court authorized Kano's trial on terrorism charges, remanding the case back to the High Court. However, the federal government followed failure to appear in court on February 8, 2024, prompted an adjournment, casting doubt on the validity of the charges against Kano. IPOP spokesman Emma Powerful expressed dismay over the federal government's reluctance to pursue the trial, interpreting it as a tacit admission of their lack of evidence against Kano. Revealing this, the president of Nigerian Bola Ahmed Tunu has pleaded to ca for calm, saying that the freedom of Nnamdi Kano already has been decided. He said the president, on his own part, is not satisfied with the conditions, but with the will of God, the court will give a precise judgment. Tunubu, there is nothing precise about this. You are the one in power. There are many ways to set the kind of free. So if, if you know that you are pleased with the judgment given by the appeal court, the appeal court on the 13th of, of June 2022, where Nnamdi Kano was discharged and acquitted, then you can use that same power and that same facts to grant Nnamdi Kano amnesty. At least as the president of Nigeria, no one will question you. You have that power and you have that right. That is if you really want to. But if you don't, it means that all you have been saying, you are just saying them because you want to gain favor from the Southeast. That's how I feel. So, my dear listeners in the house, it is now a pleasure reaching out to you on this very channel. Um, please, uh, I would like you to, I would like to hear from you. Don't forget to leave your comments below the comment section. Click on the subscription buttons as well. 
as the bell buttons to get updated each time we upload any new videos thank you